it's a lovely moment again having you in Fish College YouTube channel. I remember your humble friend, Mr. Jua Onwajiku, the pioneer of this um, channel. And one of the things I do is to give you live updates of my work. And um, the reason is that I actually discovered that a lot of persons have been having serious challenge in fish farming business, especially regarding breeding. So I try to make people understand that one of the reasons why they have that challenge is because the right knowledge is not being applied. You know, some persons just went and learned this skill casually without them, you know, they just learn how to inject and spawn without having adequate knowledge on fry management. And um, if you have been following us, you, have been, you will discover that we have been focusing much more on fry management. And there are many reasons why we are doing all these things we are doing and why we are actually showcasing our life um, practical work. Like what I'm actually doing here, I'm actually counting a fish to supply to our friend and then uh, one of our big patronizer, Lady Anne, in River State. So Lady Anne, your fan is blessed and um, I pray that Almighty God will continue to prosper your business even as you keep patronizing us. So, um, when you talk about um, hashing, hashing is not something you can just learn casually. It's um, something that is a course. It's, it's, you know, it's a course. Um, I'm just trying to see how to balance what I want to say. Fish, fishery is a course that um, takes someone five years in university, excluding IT and other things that comes along. So you cannot just jump into this system and be expecting to have the best. Um, you actually need to work with professionals that have been having repeated series of results. Like I myself, why in school, I'm a graduate of Fernando Zico University, I don't just um, depend on the skill I have. I have a lot of books that I've been reading, I have a lot of videos that I've watched, and um, I was actually involved in a lot of works, and um, by the help of God, we have been able to master some of the secrets that we have been sharing. So I want to really encourage you, if you're having one challenge or the other, don't feel that the devil is against you. Don't feel that um, one or two things is wrong. All you need to do is to look for someone that is successful and get material. Like for some time, we have actually been promoting our books. We are not just promoting this book just to for you to buy. It's because there are, there are vital informations that are in the material that you need to get. And this material, when you read them, I'm telling you the truth, it's going to help you in a long way. Now, if you feel that you are not okay with the with the material, you can join our online classes. Our online mentorship guide is also there to also guide you. What we do, you just send a little video of your farm, and the one who watch it will interview you to know how you manage your water, how you manage your feed, and other basic information that we need from you. Then we will now give you guide. We keep giving you guides until you keep getting the, the result you have been aspiring to have. This business is actually very, very technical. It's not difficult, it's actually technical. And um, the good thing is that once you do the right thing, within a period of three weeks to one month, your fish will be ready for sale. And you'll be selling and you know, you'll be happy. You'll be making beautiful money. So another thing I want to encourage um, today is when you look at the screen, you'll be seeing Green Africa be our partner. And what are we trying to promote? Look at the way our country is. People are lamenting, no job, no this, no that. So we're actually looking for, um, how will I put it, um, passionate people that will actually partner with us in promoting these skills. You know, in um, sending it across to people and helping them to learn and be empowered. And one of the things you can do is by sharing this video. When you watch it, you share it, tell people about fish college. We are not just doing us good, but we are helping our generation. Then, for those who would like us, especially pastors and community head, we can negotiate and um, we come down. There are many things we do that are profitable. Then, um, you call us, we negotiate, we come down and, you know, 
train your youth, train your community members for you and equally teach them how to start small and grow which is very much important and at this point I really want to appreciate um, NYC. NYC have been so helpful you know there's a program they call Said. Said is um skill acquisition and entrepreneurship development program and this program have really helped a lot of youth in the sense that in your one month year you actually make arrangement with partners that are willing to train which we are one of them to equip these youth with skills but it's so unfortunate that some youth when they go for their service they don't embrace this opportunity because they felt the white scholar job is here and if you are watching this video i'm actually encouraging you inspire you to not to put your hope on the white or assume white collar job i would rather encourage you to bend them and acquire a skill and develop it turn it to business and groom your life it will be pay you far much better when you have your own business running than when you are running up and down you know serving someone okay i'm not actually discouraging you from working if you really have the passion to do but um, the chance of getting work these days is very very low and then um, you can actually build yourself and you know a lot complain that they don't have capital to start and one of the things we do is to help you start small to mentor you to start small okay so in this documentary I'm gonna be watching we have a lot it's very very rich a lot of information that um, that will help you so I will encourage you to listen attentively and feel free to send your comment to us. You know, when we see wonderful comments, we feel so happy and inspired to do more. So, uh, feel free to do that, and our good Lord will continue to bless you. Okay. Now, always bear in mind that uh, we have a lot of videos that we have not really uploaded. You know, uh, we have a lot that we are doing, and um, God will help us to upload them. And I keep telling people that most of the videos you are watching us uploading are videos that are requested by our students online and um, you know people request on it on the channel so feel free to send your own requests on what we do any kind of video you want since we are consistent breeder we'll be sending them to you okay we will be uploading them you will watch and other persons will learn so we encourage you to cooperate with us work together with us let us make africa a great continent let us make nigeria a better place then if you are staying outside the country wherever you are staying and your farm is dying don't abandon it one of the things we do we revive farm we bring back farms to life so if your farm is actually dying or at the verge of dying you are not making profit this is our number this is our hotline just call this line it's also on whatsapp any challenge you know you are having regarding fish farming so feel free to give us a call and you know send us requests and uh, we'll assure you we will try and do that um, we'll try to give it professional touch and equally give you guys on how you'll be making profit in this business and um, you can equally partner with us in buying our fingerlings buying our juvenile you know we we always have them on ground so wherever you are we can always send them down to you I will have wonderful consideration. I mentioned there's mortality along the line. We we'll have a way of helping our farmers not to run into loss. Even marketing, we help our farmers to market their products. So I will actually say I love you. I love you so much. And um, it's almost time for our life lecture. I wish you all the best. Thank you. All right, hello viewers. Thank you for being part of our community. And um, I really want to appreciate every one of you that have been following us. Um, you know, we have been showing you live practicals of what we do from injection, stripping, you know, to counting. We have started, you know, giving us this fish to those who order for it because we sell mainly by order. Now, I want to say something that is very much important to actually encourage us. Meanwhile, because um, some of our clients, some of our clients find it difficult to manage fingerlings when they purchase them. So I want to make some things clear so that if you are buying fingerling, you will learn how to manage them so that they will not have um, 
mortality. So in this documentary you are watching, um, one of the things you have to note is this. If you have not trained fish before, if you know that you have not trained fish before, don't go for fingerling. Go for post or juvenile. Do you understand what I'm saying? Go for post or juvenile. Then, if you don't know what is post or juvenile, you can ask the person. Post and post are those ones that are feeding from one point and above. When you drop 1.0, 1.5, you can take it effectively. But juvenile pick 2 mm and above. Do you understand? Because um, it will be so bad that you want to economize, maybe you felt finger meat are cheaper, you buy them and then um, they now die in your hand. And because they find it difficult to acclimatize, acclimatize means to adapt to the new environment. You know, just like human be when you travel from one location to another, you have to take it some days you know, or some weeks before you can be familiar with that environment health wise. So, um, Prior to arrival, you have to ensure that you check your pH. Do you understand what I'm saying? You check your water pH. If you don't know how to check your water pH, you can buy this thing. If you can see, this is the, a kit. This is one of the kits we normally use. Look at it. So, when you get this kit, there is a chart on it. When you look at this chart, you will see um, different colors. So below the color, you see 4 to, to 9.5 here. Now, the favorable pH that can help your fish to survive without bonds. When I mean bonds is when you bring the fish, you will not be, when, you, when you put them in your pond, you will not be seeing their tails bond, their fins bond, their barbers bond. The favorable pH is between um, 6.6 .6 to 7.0. If you are using digital pH meter, I think we have the data let me bring it right. Making use of this one, you just have to insert it in the water and it will give you the reading. But you need, you need to learn how to use it properly. Then the favorable pH is between 6.5 to 7.5. All those all these things I'm telling you that in this material. This material is not just for breeding alone. We have another section that have to do with management. So because it pains me when people call me and they tell me that the fish are dying. And the funny thing is that some people complain that they, many people, most people, that they want to fold their farm, they want to close it. And um, we are crying that there is no job. So if you close your farm, who are you helping? You are not helping yourself and you are not helping the upcoming youth. Now, the government is saying clearly no job, no job. So one of the things that we can do to help the community is to create job opportunities so that. Both young and adults who don't have anything to do, can do. Now, they are closing Okada right, the various, they may even be closing Keke. And um, what do we do? So, and that because you have a lot of prospects to, to help. So, what I'm actually saying, if you're one of our clients, that, you know, one of the things we do, we do and we do very well is this. If you are buying from us, if you are buying fingerlings or juvenile or post from us, we follow you up to ensure they are doing well. Do you understand? So, if you are part of us, or you want to start a business, you can you want to start a business, you can, you know, make up your mind to patronize us. And when you patronize us, we, we ensure you that we're going to give you quality guide. The essence of giving you that guide is to ensure that you, you make good profit in the business so like some persons may be asking how do i get this very very simple go to any agricultural shop or if you find it difficult to get any of this you can chat us up and um, we will reveal it to you and in our subsequent video we are going to be teaching you how to how to balance your water for example if my water is not up to the expected or desired ph for the fish how do I balance it? So we are going to be doing the video in our subsequent episodes to show you how to do it because we are interested in helping farmers make good success. We are, I'm tired of hearing all those um, news of fish dying, you know, of uh, many, many problems in the farm. So, and um, we want more people to invest into agriculture. We want more people to invest into agriculture because um, 
there is high prospects in agriculture. When you practice it, you have food at the table, you have money, you create employment to many. So what I'm actually doing right now, that I've been watching, I've been counting this fish from some set of persons who want to deliver to. And I want to explain literally what we are doing. Here I have so many sticks that call that have been caught. So what I do when I count hundred, I drop one. Like uh, so far I've counted one, two, three, four, five, six. So this is six hundred. So once I finish, if I count one, I actually count four thousand. Once I count forty, um, forty, six, that means I've gotten four thousand, and then um, I pack it and continue my counting. Then one of the necessary precautions you have to take note of while counting. One, you have to ensure that you have to ensure that you have um, a, a you have a, a board. A board that is very very smooth so that um, the fish will not sustain injury. Help me with that glass that you normally do with that glass. Or you make use of glass. You know, you make use of glass. You make use of glass. Then why counting? I want to explain something clearly. Like the fish are not others equal. Uh, this is one of the things we use. This is glass and it's very very sweet. Why using it? Because once you put water it's smooth, it doesn't generates any kind of friction that will that will hurt the fish. You just put your all your fish here and start your counting. So why counting you'll be removing because they're not equal. So when you remove the big one, it's not that you are cheating your buyer because it's not that you are cheating them. You are not cheating them. Because some people normally say uh, fresh fish and super shooter. Actually uh, we, we know that those ones that are taking advantage of the other ones are good. But from my own experience, when you give this fish good care, all of them do well. All of them do well. So look at how I'm going to count. So I, I, I enjoy using glass very well than board, but this board is smooth. There are some boards that are rough, don't use them. So look at what I'm going to do. This is a one, two, three, four. Yeah, I've got him at 20, so I will not drop one stick. See, very, very simple. So this is what we do, and it's not a must because at times, um, this counting one by one is stressful. So when you know that you are exhausted, you are tired, you can you talk the fish very well, and after resting, you continue. Then I still want to encourage our leaders. If you're a leader and you're watching us, there's something we are promoting now, which is skilled Africa and green Africa. As you can see, everywhere is green. <laughs> so what I'm trying to do is a mindset, a revolution that we want to want to move, which is to encourage people to partner with us. You can partner with my organization to empower your youth. So, but what we do, we, we are not always free. You know, we are busy. So when you want us to train your youth, either your community or your church, which is very good. By so doing, you are affecting life. You inform us on time, we discuss and make the arrangement and we plan it. So we shall do or how it is gonna be. 
I want to go to the of training that when we train people, we have so many fans that are under our care. We can employ those who don't have anything doing, provided they are competent. So the only problem we have is that when people are not well trained and you employ them, I remember a time I employed two persons and then we just within a month we lost fees that was over five hundred thousand. And then I cannot ask them to pay. <laughs> and so that caused me that major of so fee that was um, over three hundred thousand. She was crying. Crying, she brought the parents. So I now resolved that you know before you employ people, you need to ensure that they are well trained. So when we have people that are well trained, employment is not the issue because there is money in this business. So you can partner with us to you know to create more employment opportunity for youth in the community. You know by rendering them quality training them. Don't be shy. You know when we talk about our books, some people feel we are emphasizing on money. Get the material, everything I'm teaching you are in this material. Everything is in this material. The material is very, very rich. I'm happy for those who have been reading and they actually send you wonderful appreciation on what they have learned so far. So I expect you to do likewise, okay? And um, I still want to remind you my name. Actually, the name of my channel is Fish College, but my real name is um, Mwas Kujua Chigoze. By the grace of God, I'm a product of Nnamdi Aziko University, and um, from Enugu State. So I'm Monibu. My country is Monibu now, from Sukaluka government. So, and then by God's grace, we have actually been doing this work. We have been affecting lives. We have been training Jews and so many people. We have been. You no, know, I don't know how to put it. We turn our glory to God. So. I want you to partner with us then. You can equally be buying fingering from us and we sell it. You know, you buy, we trade them as juvenile or post. Because what to do many we raise fingering. We only raise juvenile and post on demand. Like you want us to raise them for you. You have to make some deposits, quality deposits. Then we will now raise them up for you. Okay? So we have a lot of videos, live videos, not just comedy live videos of our work so i love you so much i want to share a success story with you i really want to share your success story with you so thank you for following me Thank you. Thank you. What's up,